three. I used to LAN every weekend in high school, and I still love LAN parties, right? I love just the setup and the cords everywhere. And I remember I, I was at this LAN party, and um, it was me and my brother and Dane and Bean, and um, one of our other friends was there, and he was playing pretty competently. We were playing some free-for-alls. He was looking really good. And when I went over to watch him, uh, you know, because I got killed <laughs> pretty quickly. Uh, by the way, Dane and I, anytime there was a free-for-all or some team game, Dane and I only suicide to kill each other. Like, seriously. We'll be playing on, like, uh, I don't know, some gigantic map, you know, like like Garden of War, Hunters style big, Primeval Isles style big. And we'll just, like, you know, five pool each other and <laughs> try to kill each other. So I was dead. Dane had killed me. He triumphed. Um, so I went over to watch my friend play, and he just drank a Coke with his left hand and played with just his mouse. And it, he looked pretty damn good. He wasn't Jadong by any means, but he looked really, 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 really good for the fact that he was just using this because he just played a lot and remembered to do the things that he needed to do. And then after that, I was like, you know, Tom, you can... You can use hotkeys. You can do this other stuff. And he's kind of, ah, uh, he resisted. And when he did it, you know, his play improved. But it wasn't like hotkeys brought him from D plus to A plus, you know. He, he was like probably a C minus C level player with his mouse hand. Um, and then he, of course, once he started using the keyboard, he started to slowly chip his way up. It was another tool that he used. But again, that's the core focus fundamental. So... We have, we've talked a little bit about keyboard control. One last thing I want to note is mouse control. Um, so I'm going to come actually here to the gameplay menu. Uh, I actually spent a long time fiddling with the sensitivity. And there's a lot of checks that uh, right now, 63%. Oh, baby, does that feel good. I love that. That is just fantastic. Um, you want to... Oh, I lost money. Can I get that money back? No, I lost my money. Oh well, what? Whatever. Actually, let me try this thing. Uh, Shift F3 reloads it as Zerg, but of course has to reload the whole map. All right, sweet. Yeah, that worked out great. So again, let's use our Protoss pieces in this instance. Um, so it's really important that when you build these guys, you don't click them back here. I think that <coughs> probably um, the biggest thing preventing the B plus level player to becoming the A minus level player. And let me actually not use the PG Tour rankings. Something that really prevents the top, like, quarter percent from moving into the top eighth percent. And again, notice how high the level is. It's super high. I think a big reason is just not super precise mouse control. And um, so, you know, if you're ultra low level, you don't need to freak out about, oh my god, do I have bad mouse control. But you get a lot of people who are super fast, like they have this hotkey, and they have their, their probes hotkeys, and they're like, oh yeah, I'm going to do this stuff. And they're like, oh my god, I'm going to build a probe, yeah, and then they overshoot it like crazy, you know. Um, and that's obviously bad to do, you don't want to be doing that. Um, so what are some exercises that we can do to help improve our mouse control? It's pretty easy to get down with the keyboard because it's just like, well, what is my hand capable of doing? And of course, everyone's pretty much used to their hands doing what they want to do unless some of you are possessed by some sort of odd gnomes in your brain and your hands do whatever they want. Unless that's the case, your hands are very quickly going to become pretty comfortable with doing this 1-5 stuff. And again, I'm not hotkeying my Nexus as 2. The reason I don't like this sort of crowding with my Nexus is because, you know, first of all, if my Nexus is 2, I've immediately run out of space. And what do I have 3 as? My Scout? That's weird to have 1 as a unit, 2 as a building, 3 as a Scout. Yeah, you don't want that. Um, but, um, what are we talking about? Let me just come back here again. Yeah, so a lot of people are going to get pretty used to the keyboard hand. And they're going to kind of ignore the mouse. The mouse is, again, like a servant in their eyes. It does kind of what they want to do. Um, but you want it to do exactly what you want it to do. So you'll see a lot of players spamming at the start. And this is what happens. People... It's almost like people watch too many movies. It's like they watch the Hollywood version of StarCraft and they saw people... Yeah! Oh my god, they're doing it. Oh, Jesus, I just dragged the StarCraft 2 window out. Okay, see, see how bad that is? It's even bad for a caster. Let's try to bring this window back up. <laughs> Let me actually briefly check my server monitor to make sure that I centered it uh, at least somewhat properly. That looks pretty reasonable. Actually, that's pretty damn accurate. Ooh, I'm, I'm pretty pleased with myself in that regard. Okay, coming right back here. <laughs> awesome. Totally, totally good. So, 
all right now that we've got this set up yes um so th th they'll do this and they'll be spamming and they're like oh i really am good i really do have high apm okay i'm gonna build this pile on all right cool all right yeah i got my shift hockey q set up all right cool all right awesome uh okay um let me actually just do this one more time so they'll oh my god they'll oops missed my button <coughs> excuse me yeah, so they'll do this clicking thing, because again, I spam at the start of my games. I, you know, I spam. It looks something like this, but we'll see how it's different in a moment. You know, oh my god! And then, you know, okay, they're gonna get ready. They're gonna build their pylon. They're gonna build their pylon. Okay, you know, what? let's hotkey a probe. So that way we can spam even faster. I'm going one five boxes, one five boxes. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Oh god! If people hit that APM key in the first what thirty seconds of the game, my god, they'll think I'm Korean. They'll actually think I underwent surgery to become Korean. And actually, I did that um, actually correctly. But then they'll come down here and they'll be like, "Okay," and they'll and and they'll overshoot like that. And they'll, oh, okay, 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 okay. That's okay. It's okay. You know, cool. APM, APM, APM. Spam, spam, spam. And that's awful, right? This is clearly bad. I think everyone has gotten the sense that I apparently have some deep disdain for people who do this. But um. Here's an exercise to deal with mouse control, and if anyone sits behind me, they'll see me do this, even nowadays I do this, where I will make a box here, and then I will try to swing my mouse up and click directly on the minerals. I'll try to rally right here very quickly. It's a little hard, because right now this um, is a windowed mode. Um, I'm, <laughs> I don't actually play StarCraft on a tiny window on my stream. I only uh, stream that way. But, you know, I try to make sure that I am clicking that button really fast. So, for instance... Uh, again, ignore my money. Let's ignore timing for a moment. Let's cancel this probe. Um, so let's actually pull these three. Oh, hell, let's just restart it. <laughs> so I'm going to tell all my guys to mine. And I haven't built anything yet. So what I'm noticing is that these two top mineral patches aren't being mined from. And I want to rally to them. So that when my probe pops out. Just as an exercise for my mouse, if I click like this, that's actually bad. If I, if I try to swing and I do a swing and a miss up there. So I try to make sure that I absolutely can box and rally exactly here. And I actually hit 5-5 five, five and I click just right up there. And oh, oh, overshot it, so I have to readjust. And you'll see me do this a lot. And then what happens is I'll start rallying. I'll, I'll say, okay, I'm gonna box, rally, and click this bottom mineral. That's just the sequence I wanna do. So I wanna, I want to, okay, cancel it. I want to, E, so I'm gonna go five five right click left click right click left click right I want to be able to be able to right click left click so five five right click left click okay cool and so now I have a nice little setup going where I'm clicking between these two and that's pretty accurate I'm pretty pleased with that especially considering it's windowed yeah go me um, but it's a very easy thing to make sure your mouse control is precise. So then I even set up silly little sequences for myself. So I'm going to rally to this right patch, but then I'm going to click here, and then I'm going to click click here. So I try to get in the habit of right-clicking like that. So right-click, left-click, left-click. Right-click, left-click, left-click. Right-click, left-click, left-click. Uh, just an easy way to see if my mouse control is too high or too low. So, you know, let me, let me actually increase my mouse sensitivity. And this actually will completely screw things up so that's a 76 percent holy crap that's sensitive so you know if i'm trying to do this then i'll go click right click left click and notice that when i try to do it fast i'm overshooting the bottom one is what i'm noticing i can do an okay job on the top one but i'm definitely overshooting the bottom one and my hands starting to adjust to it but already it, it's going a little bit to the left i'm not actually trying to force it to do that it's just what my, my hand is naturally doing and um God, now I have to do the struggle to get it to 63%. Yeah, there we go. And that is honestly some nice little exercise. And actually, when you see players make boxes like this, what I actually do when I make boxes, I try to make it from the left side of the nexus just to the right side of these minerals. Uh, or should I say from the right side of the nexus to the left side of the minerals. I just try to make a box right here, uh, as small as I can. So again, I'm going to right click, left click, and then you'll see me make some boxes like that. Just getting my mouse control to be how I want it to. Because if I was overshooting it, if I was doing a box like that size, wouldn't exactly be the best thing. So here's some nice exercises to train this. Not absolutely critically important. Definitely not the sort of thing where if you don't do it, you lose. Clearly, clearly not the case. But it is the sort of thing that uh, if you do, you will be able to squeeze forward a little bit more. So um, 
I definitely like that, that little bit. Um, and plus, I'm not going to lie, when your mouse hand feels good, you will just want to play StarCraft more and more and more and more. It literally, I once I got my mouse settings right, I was just like, oh my god, I could play all night. One thing to note um, about mouse sensitivity, so I'm going to actually bring my mouse up here. So, I mean, I have, so I have a Razer. I, I love my Razer. Um... So when I, when I hold my mouse hand, you'll notice that I kind of have uh, these two fingers. I have my pinky and my ring finger kind of holding on to the right side. And I have my thumb here. And it's just sort of gripping uh, there. Um, and what's really happening, and I'll come back to just the hand. What's really happening is that when you move somewhere, either your thumb or these fingers...